Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. I am Alex with Cat to Me Geek and today I am back filming another Dollar Tree haul. Now this is a part two of sorts. I did a really big haul several days ago. I don't even remember when and so I'm just kind of breaking this up into different parts for y'all. So I have so many different things to show y'all. It would take like an hour to show it all to you in one video. So this is going to be part two and I have no idea where it's going to end. There might be a part three. I'm not sure at this point, but we'll see as we go along. So let's get started. Okay. I'm going to start off with this. This is kind of like one of, I think this was one of the items that a lot of people were hauling and other people were excited about it, but the first time they put these out at my store, all they had it in was blonde. They never had brunette. So just kind of like a see if it works or see how bad it might be type of thing. I did buy one. This is the Revlon Glam Wrap. This is in medium brown. They only had this in brown this time, whereas all of the times before they never had it in brown. So. I'm actually just going to mess with this right now because why not? Uh, put hair in a bun. Check. <laughs> uh, wrap done. Okay, so they say it's as easy as that. So. Ooh. This looks really messy. What do y'all think? I have no idea how it looks. I'll figure it out when I get home, but I think I'm just going to leave that there for the rest of the filming just to see what y'all think of it. Let me know in the comments how this looks. <laughs> okay, so there's that. Um, and then I found this, which I think I'm going to open this up as well because I just feel like opening things today. This is a compact, portable, on-the-go mini razor. And yes, it really says all of that. One of those would have been fine. They didn't need all of those. So, it says it is a mini razor with moisturized, rich strips. A uh, portable case protects the blades and is perfect for on the go. And this is by Greenbrier. This is by the Assured label. Silky skin, gentle smoothness. Let's see exactly what this is. Okay, so this is what the little case looks like. Looks kind of like a soap, a travel soap case, soap saver thing. And this is genuinely tiny. Oh my gosh. Pretty much like hold it like that, I guess, as you're shaving. I don't know. Okay. I could I could totally get on board with this as far as travel. This is really cool actually. Huh. Well, there's no telling how it how well it actually shaves. It probably shaves about as well as the other Dollar Tree razors. Is that changeable? It is changeable. I'll have to see if they have any refill uh, razor blades next time. That's pretty cool. And it does have a drain here, so water doesn't just stay in there and rust it out. Okay. Okay, I actually really like that. Um, so I don't know how it shaves, obviously, but I have used Assured razors before and they work just as well as Bic. So this is probably just like a Bic razor. And Bic has always been my favorite. Like, I would get the nice uh, razors where you can just buy the replacement blades and it's like, no, I would just continue to buy my little disposable dicks. 
I don't know why. I just, I just prefer them. Is it thick? Big razors? Because I know there are big pins. Am I thinking of something else? Are there big razors? <laughs> anyway, moving on. After the razor, or a few items over, I actually found this bikini shave gel that I've seen a couple of people haul. It says, compared to Bikini Zone Anti-Bumps Shave Gel. This is moisturizing formula, won't irritate sensitive skin, gently fragranced for bikini area, aloe vera, vitamins A and E, shea butter, chamomile. Five ounces. And this is Greenbrier again, I think. Yes, no, maybe. Manufactured for Delta Brands Inc. DeltaBrands.com. So this is not Dollar Tree. This is actually sealed. I was gonna smell it, but I don't feel like opening a gel up in the vehicle. Last time I did that, there was a mess, so. Yeah. But whenever I eventually get around to trying this out, um, I'll let y'all know if it's any good, if I remember. It's just, I won't know if I remember. <laughs> and then I found the Dentec 100 count double pick deep clean bristle picks. Textured and bristled, removes food and plaque, uh, fights tooth decay, stimulates gums. Now normally the Dollar Tree has like 10 counts of these. So when I saw the 100 count, I was like, yes, I need to find those. I think it was Feely at Thrifty Divas. I think it was her that I saw haul these. So whenever I saw that, I did go and get those. I probably should have gotten more than one pack, but I just got the one pack. Um, we've never used stuff like that, and I figured hundreds a lot, so we can see if we like them at least. Next, I got a few food items. I did. I got the Bud's Best Vanilla Wafers. This is an 8 ounce box. And I thought that banana pudding sounded really good, so I got these to make some banana pudding at some point. We have lots of pudding at the house, so <laughs> that is why I got those. But also to go along with those, I got some cookie butter and hazelnut chocolate duo spread. Now I always see this at my Dollar Trees, and this is the first time I'm actually buying it. I do like cookie butter, I do like hazelnuts, so I figured, you know, why not? Why not? So I did get this. This is seven ounces. And this is by Italian. Imported by Evergreen USA LLC, New Jersey, Italian.com. And so I don't know if this is at all Dollar Trees or if it's sold anywhere other than Dollar Tree, but yeah, grabbed one of those. Figured I'd give that a try. And then these have been out for a while, but I do have a sister's birthday coming up and my mom really enjoys stuff like this too. Like um, I gave her a bunch of little blind bags and some, uh, some of the little pimpy pops where you like uh, pop the gel packet and you find a little character inside. She absolutely loved it. So I got a set of these for my mom and a set for my sister. And these are the, I don't know why I'm trying to hold all of them. These are the Ectoplasm Ghostbusters Slime. And these look like little uh, beaker type vials. These are 1.35 ounces of slime with a minifigure inside. Now when these first came to Dollar Tree, I saw Jennifer Moen haul these and she did read the numbers on the top and opened up one of each number to see if it meant different characters. 
and it did. So I got one of each set for each my mom and my sister. So one WA is one character. And then two, three, and four are different characters as well. So I think there were four different ones to collect. So I got one through four. And yeah. So I thought those were really cool. I did ask my mom how she felt about slime before I bought these though. Because I wasn't sure if she would be happy with me or not for getting these for her. But she's like, yeah, bring on the slime. So I will... I will give her these and she can enjoy these. And then we're at 11 minutes so I think these are going to be the last few items that I share with y'all. Um, I got some of this nail polish remover with the spill proof pump. This is a six ounce bottle. This says this one is for natural nails. There was also one that said it was like a... This one says regular. There was one that was like a... Whatever's more than regular. Extra. Whatever. <laughs> but that one was recommended for acrylics. This one is recommended for natural nails. And it says it does have a locking lid. So... Is the lock. Not sure how secure that is, but but yeah, I figured I would get one of those. I'm not sure if I'll keep this for myself or give it to my mom and sister. They paint their nails a lot more than I do. I rarely ever paint my nails. Um, but yeah, I just went ahead and got this, and I figured, you know, after this goes through also get the pump from it so I mainly wanted the pump rather than the uh the nail polish remover itself but you know I can I can use it up I can I can find a way to use it up and then I got some light bulbs our fans our our light fixture on our fan in our room and in our roommate's room down the hall um we had a power surge and all the the light bulbs just kind of blew like they just didn't work anymore so I went and I bought some more light bulbs I did get like four packs of these but I've already taken some in the house so we can put them in the lamp in the uh the fans so this is the only pack that's left out here but I did go and get these these are 40 watt dimmable bulbs two bulbs for a dollar. I was looking on uh, Walmart's website at my local prices and 40 watt chandelier bulbs, two 40 watt chandelier bulbs were going to be at least like four dollars at my store right now, at my Walmart. So I was like, mm, I'll see if they have it at Dollar Tree first. So I think this was the main reason why I went into Dollar Tree this day that I did because this was like the day or the morning after. I think it was like the morning after our fan lights blew out. So you can thank the electrical surge for this Dollar Tree haul. Okay, and yeah, these are going to be the last two items that I share with you. I'm going to put the rest of this stuff in a third part so y'all can enjoy that in a few days. Now, I have no idea if Dollar Tree's had these before. Um, I don't remember seeing them before. I only started doing um, Dollar Tree YouTube stuff last August, last September, October, something like that. But I've been shopping at Dollar Tree basically my whole life. And especially since I started college. So, I've been an avid Dollar Tree shopper since 2014, and I don't remember seeing these. If they were there, they just got looked over, but these are at least new for this season. Maybe not new, 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 but new for the season because these were freshly put out. 
when I brought them up to the front, the cashier was like, oh my God, those are so cute. So they are fresh out of the box or they were several days ago. They had four different colors. They had pink, purple, blue, and orange. And they had two different sayings cut into them. They had read and inspire. I just got two. I got this blue one that says read and the orange one that says inspire. I thought these were really cute. These are metal bookends and they do have um, feet on the bottom to keep them from sliding and they also have a little hole here so if you need to nail it into place or something I guess like that's what I would use it for like if it if I really didn't want it to slide you know a little a little picture hanging nail or something there would definitely keep it from falling off so I got those I thought those were really cute So anyway, that is everything that I have to share with you today. I'd like to thank you for stopping by and joining me today. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. If you enjoyed this video, please consider hitting the like and subscribe buttons down below. It would really help out this channel. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.